Sharon, Sharon has invaded the West Bank. They're slaughtering innocent people. And I'm sick of worshiping Israel. But you know, back in the 1960s, they bombed the USS Liberty knowing it was one of our ships because it caught the radio chatter of them killing thousands of Palestinian children during that invasion. And they torpedoed it as they begged for hours on the radio. And LBJ sat there at 63 and let them do it. That's in this Baltimore Sun story. I don't support the Palestinians either. They're all hyped up and psychotic. But Israel's going to get us nuked, always backing them up like this. Israel calls the Palestinians goyim or cattle or dogs or subhuman. They keep them on concentration camps. I've got video of them taking Palestinian women's tomatoes they grow and breaking their water containers and stealing. That, that's why you have this crap. And our children are going to die. We're going to get nuked because of this. Iran's got the nukes now. Syria. We're going to have nuclear war. Because Israel likes to go around bombing everybody. I'm sorry. It's just the facts. And Israel absolutely is beside itself with joy right now. They are talking about how they're going to blow everything up, how they're going to attack everybody. I guess he's going to get bombed because of it. I have been supportive of Israel for many years. When I thought of what they do, shooting little Palestinian children in the genitalia and laughing, it's on video. Little Palestinian, little ten-year-olds walk around throwing rocks and tanks. A guy sits off a half mile away and blows their testicles off. They call them goyim. They call them dogs. They call them Arabs cattle. And then the Arab, corrupt Arab governments that are in league with this government, it's really a sick Hegelian dialectic order out of chaos, bringing the world crises, bringing them terrorism, so we'll accept a highly dictatorial police state regime. It's happening.